told I'm good at it. So uh, throughout school and college, every year I've never missed a chance to dance. <laughs> and uh, my some of my recent uh, performances has been in my own sangeet a couple of years ago, and in my friend's sangeets. So I just love dancing, and I dance like nobody's watching. That's the that's the spirit. I think that's wow, the wow. Uh, yes, yes. So great. So with this prelude. Hello everyone I'm Dr Nupur Goyal and thank you very much the OT team Dr Sonal Dr Apurva Namrata ma'am for giving me this opportunity to speak on this wonderful topic of dancing your worries away I'm not here to give much gyan rather I would just share you know what I have experienced and how dancing helps me so I don't know if it helps you too So I just took a small survey at my own institute. Uh, you know, people how what do dance mean to them, and got some really wonderful um, responses from everyone. A divine way, uh, Dr. Prashant. Uh, he feels that it's an art, and I am not that artist for sure. And couple of wonderful responses. These are the other ophthalmologists who are good dancers, my very good friends. It's for them also. They have the expression of dance is different for some. It's fitness. For some, it's it's just expressing yourself. It's it's just about dancing, like not getting from one place to another, but just just enjoying every step. For some, it's just just letting your head down and have fun. And of course, Dr. Priya was a very good friend. It's, she says it's an SSRI for her. Then also, some people feel it makes our bones stronger. So, um, going further, dance the literal dictionary meaning is moving rhythmically to music, typically following a set of sequence of steps. For me, dancing is the closest thing to magic. Fine. So, uh, dance for me is a de-stressor. It's athletic. It is about having non-stop musty and fun. Making it has helped me make a lot of connections and new friends, and it has enhanced me professionally. So, my whole talk I would be elaborating this this acronym dance aspect. Uh, before that, I'll just tell you a little about myself, my journey as a dance. I started dancing at a very early age, at the age of five years. Just it just just happened, you know. So I am a trained Kathak dancer. I have given three exams, uh, although not completed the course. Completing that is surely on my bucket list. Uh, participated throughout MBBS, MS fellowship, and now also I keep performing as in when. So as you can see, I started dancing at an early age. Dressing up. This, these are. This is my first year MBBS, second year MBBS. This was one of the uh, Marathi uh, uh, festivals we used to have in our college. I have done my MBBS from Mumbai. Then this, we had gone for a youth fair um, in Stuttgart, Germany. Uh, represented India at an international level. So this was our team. Uh, we, I was during my internship at Nair Hospital, Mumbai. So during my MS as well, I whenever I got a chance, I performed. Uh, this was uh, we would go out for dandya night. Um, then. Post my fellowship after I just was dancing with my daughter at one of the Ganpati festivals with my friends. These are the other moms at a peach festival. This was the AIOT cultural dance. Then one of the events. So coming to the uh, elaborating aspect, the stressor. I don't have to stress on the de-stressing aspect of dance. Everybody, I'm sure, can associate with it. It has a lot of scientific uh, things to support it as well. So this. Um, Very good book, uh, Dr. Sonal has actually shared with me uh, burnout, and this um, uh, actually says that you know the whenever you're stressed out, uh, rather than just just following and just relax, utilize that energy, and the best way to have it is some form of physical activity. For me, it's dance. It definitely helps you de-stress yourself. Um, so nothing else, nothing can clear a mental cobweb faster than a good dance. As Apurva said, dance as no one is watching you. Da don't dance for anyone else. Just dance for yourself because it makes you happy. Dance is the joy of movement and the heart of life. Athletic coming to the fitness aspect. So this is my fellowship photo. Uh, uh, so you can see the different post fellowship I have pursued dance, fitness in various forms. Watching YouTube videos, Zumba videos, uh, more pursuing dance, and you can see the difference. So yes, it is. It is a very very important. Um, Uh, has a very important fitness aspect to it. Um, so non-stop musty and fun. This is my uh, PG uh, time photo. Uh, we would just, you know, go to a place. This, this, or just in our hostel rooms, we would play music and just, just dance our heart out. You know, so this is about having non-stop musty and fun connections. It has, especially during the lockdown period, it has helped me to make so many new friends. um um uh, we connected virtually we connected we had a lot of collaborations dance videos and uh, we now actually have a group you know where all of us have connected to dance but now 
we are the best of friends some of us have haven't even met but that's how so dance has helped me uh, develop so many connections and so many new friends it has enhanced me professionally it has built up my confidence people know me more so there have been couple of virtual cultural programs where i have participated it helps me surgically too it helps me keep me more focused discipline it gives me a more positive frame of mind so um, so great dancers i would say are not because of their technique they are because of their passion and i'm really really passionate about dancing i hope that you all also find this passion it's it's not about being a good dancer or a bad dancer it's it's just about